Hello, Cancer. Welcome to uh, your reading here. Thank you for being here at Pretty Intuitive. Um, please give this video a thumbs up if you feel um, that you resonate with the reading and you would like to see, obviously, more Cancer content on this channel. All right, Cancer, let's get into it. Let's see what is coming your way in love. Cancer, what is coming to Cancer in love, please? Cancer, Cancer, Cancer in love, what is coming to Cancer? Cancer. Oh. Okay, so Cancer, you have let your friends help you, new love, and you deserve love, okay? Um, so it does feel like a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Okay, you deserve love. You are lovable. Let's see what's up with that. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What is coming? What is coming to Cancer in love, please? Let me get eight cards for Cancer and Love, Cancer. Okay, so Cancer, you have the Nine of Wands. Um, guarded. Guarded. Defensive. Um, you or your person. Scared. Worried. <laughs> uh, frustrated. These could all be the emotions that is kind of like in play here. Okay, what's coming to Cancer and Love? Some of you are dealing with a Taurus. You know what I feel like, Cancer? Um, there's definitely a lot of trust issues here. I feel like there's definitely someone that you could be seeing. Okay, currently or you will be. This could be something that plays out in the future. Um, someone that you're seeing, right? Not necessarily in a relationship with that... It's either you, like I said, or this person. Uh, there are trust issues here, okay? So if you notice your person being very standoffish or whatever the case may be, it's because there are trust issues. Um, maybe this is someone you're just friends with, okay? It does feel like somebody wants to kind of get out, get out of that friend zone. Um, yeah, this could be kind of strictly friends right now. The Hierophant, Taurus energy. Coming to Cancer and Love, tell me more. So I think this is someone that you enjoy being around. Uh, they enjoy being around you. I think that um, the problem is not you, it's them, okay? Could be done with another Cancer, Taurus, Strongly, Scorpio. There's trust issues in the situation. Somebody has their, their wall so freaking high, and they expect for you to climb over it, Cancer Honey, okay? Yeah. Someone's guard is really, really up, very high. Um, I don't know. I just think there's a lot of trust issues here. Remember, general readings can be uh, vice versa. I feel like someone's really afraid of getting their heart broken. They're afraid of pain, getting broken, heartbroken. It's coming to cancer and love. Tell me more. Some of you, um, you're used to being in love triangles. Maybe you're used to getting cheated on or this person's used to getting cheated on. And that could be a factor, okay? Because like I said, trust issues are running amok in this connection, okay? Um, someone just doesn't trust. That's just what I'm seeing here. Yeah, you see, someone has went through a lot of betrayals, backstabbing. Somebody really, really, really has been hurt a lot in the past, okay? That's what, what's going on here. It's not that they just want to be friends with you, but their trust issues keep them from letting their guard down and trusting that way they can, you guys can move forward in that way, Okay. Some of you, this could be someone, um, for like a small percentage of you, this is someone that 
you're currently talking to, seeing, but maybe they have a third party. And this is not something that you're going to necessarily invest all of your time in because you don't want to end up being, you know, get the short end of the stick and end up getting hurt. You know what I'm saying? And they stay with their third party. However it resonates for you. We have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. We have Taurus. We have Cancer and Scorpio. Yeah, somebody's really, really afraid. I feel like someone wants to give this a chance, but at the same time, they just don't want to get their hopes up. So this is why someone is approaching the connection really casually, you know? Because they're trying to avoid getting hurt. So they're trying not to have too high of an expectation. Yeah, some of you are dealing with a Taurus. I feel like someone's like, you know, I'd rather focus on my money. I'd rather focus on me. I don't trust, like, relationships. I don't trust people. You know, there, it's just like a really paranoid kind of energy. And it's crazy because the person that you're connecting with, um, Cancer, if it's them that's acting like this, they have all the qualities, you know, to be, like, a really, really good partner. They have all these qualities within them. But they're just not showcasing them and they're not tapping into them because they, I'm hearing their kindness was taken for weakness in the past. Okay. And they suffered greatly when they cared, when they were loyal, when they were supportive, when they were, you know, all these things. Okay. So I'm hearing like, look where caring got me. You know what I'm saying? So you're dealing with somebody here who is extremely, extremely uncomfortable with trusting, okay? And don't get it twisted. That's why I said I feel like this person is genuinely interested. I think this person loves you very much. They like you very much. The feelings are strong, everything. But again, I just think that that's what's going on here with this person. So, not going to lie to you, it does feel like this is someone who just kind of wants to be casual at this point in time. Okay, they're not necessarily trying to turn this into anything serious. And again, it's not because of you, but because of them. It, it has a lot to do with them, okay? Courage, you know, it's going to take them a lot of courage, confidence to um, open their heart up. Healing, this person still has healing to do third party some of this freak has a third party okay and it could be showcasing your feelings of not wanting to get hurt from the situation okay um but for others of you it does say cheating interference competition it just feels like this person has been it's either i don't know but i don't know like let's say this is an ex who cheated on you right you don't trust them or vice versa let's say you cheated on this person that, that's why they, they have a tough time um, wanting to take this further or get back together. Maybe they're just like, let's just be friends, okay? Um, but other than that, yeah, cheating is a big theme in this reading, meaning that someone has really been hurt a lot of times. And I just don't think that they're ready just yet, okay? Because you do have divine timing, so it's only a matter of time before this person does eventually, um, you know, heal from this, work through this, open their heart again. But you're going to you're gonna need a lot of patience with this type of person. Okay? That's just the truth. You know, and that's the truth here. You can clearly see um, how he's looking. He's like, oh, I don't know. I, I just have trust issues. I don't think, you know, there's a lot of doubt. You know, somebody's filled with a lot of doubt. 
moving forward with this. Okay. Okay, Cancer. So, I hope this video was informative. I hope this reading gave you what you needed. Um, and I will talk to you guys soon.